Hi everyone, this is Lisa Brown at Stamp with Lisa Brown and thank you for joining me today. I wanted to talk about the um, textured uh, impressions embossing folders which in the 2019-2020 catalog we are now calling 3D embossing folder. Stampin' Up! is renaming their product line of dies and embossing folders. So they were previously um, under the label of uh, the Sizzix Big Shot and our thick textured embossing folders, these are the really thick ones, were previously known as the Dynamic Textured Impression Embossing Folder. In the 2019-2020, we are renaming them the 3D Embossing Folder, and it's going to be called the Stampin' Cut and Emboss. And this goes for uh, the die cuts and the uh, embossing folders. And that's not just the 3D embossing folders, it's the whole entire line. So I wanted to explain uh, the difference in the embossing folders. The previous, the previous embossing folders are a little bit thicker than what you're going to receive in the new catalog. Uh, they're just slightly thinner. The previous ones, which obviously you're going to be able to tell that it's the other style because it still has the Sizzix logo on it. You'll see with the new ones, the Sizzix logo is uh, has been removed. For the previous version, when you were die cutting on your Big Shot, you would put your paper in your embossing folder and you would use your base platform, no spacer, okay? Here's your base platform. Then you would put your piece of uh, cardstock in the embossing folder and you would put one clear plate on and you would run it through your big shot. Okay, with the new ones, because they're not as thick as the old ones, you're still going to use your base platform on your die cutting machine. Okay, you're going to put your paper in your bossing folder. And Stampin' Up! has come out with a 3D embossing folder plate and it's kind of a purpley blue plate and you put this on top and that's how you run it through your die cut machine um, this plate is thicker than the standard plate if you wanted to use a standard plate you can however you are going to have to add anywhere five, six pieces of um, paper in there as a shim. And what I mean by that, you would just take some cardstock and you would place it underneath like this. And you would create that thickness and then put your embossing folder down and put this down. But with them coming out with the 3D embossing folder plate, there is no guesswork. You don't have to put in any paper shims. You're just going to put your um, paper in the embossing folder on the base plate and put the uh, 3D embossing folder down and you're going to run it through your machine. The um, plate is available. It is in the 2019-2020 annual catalog. It's item number 149658, and the plate is $10. Uh, so again, you're going to tell the difference by whether it has the Sizzix logo or not. And the reason that that is important is because all of the 3D embossing folders 
that carried over, let me rephrase it, all of the uh, dynamic texture impressions embossing folders that carried over from the old catalog into the new catalog, when you get them, they're going to be the new style. Even though, for example, the subtle embossing folder that I have here is the thick one, with the Sizzix logo in the new catalog, you're going to receive it in the new style and in the new style. Again, you're going to need to use the 3d embossing folder plate to run that through. Uh, please visit my shop at stamp with Lisa Brown .net, And you can get your uh, embossing folder plate today. Any questions, email me at lbrown140 at gmail.com. Have a good day.